When discussing the power and accuracy of handgun cartridges, the debate is usually centered around the 9mm versus the 45 ACP. But there's another gun that's often left out of this debate, the 10mm. Guns chambered in 10mm can pump out a whopping 650 to 800 pounds of muzzle energy. That is nothing to sneeze at for a variety of practical purposes. With that in mind, we went ahead and did the research to find some of the best 10mm pistols on the market today. Whether you're looking for a concealed carry gun with above average firepower or something for the brush, you're sure to find something you like in this list. Springfield Armory XDM Like the Glock, this gun offers an awesome 15 plus 1 magazine capacity. This fully ambidextrous semi-automatic pistol weighs in at just 31 ounces. It has a match-grade 5-inch barrel, a melanite-coated slide, a fiber-optic front sight, and a fully adjustable rear sight. An accessory rail allows you to attach things like a flashlight or sights. Springfield Armory is thoughtful enough to include three magazines right out of the box. There are also three interchangeable back straps to adjust the fit to each individual shooter. At $699, you're getting a lot for your money with XDM. Smith & Wesson M&P 10mm M2.0 Smith & Wesson was late to the best 10mm pistol party, but it's here now, and some people will be saying a silent prayer of thanks to see the M&P 10mm here. This 10mm is built on the M&P M2.0 45 auto frame and offers a 16-round capacity with a grip and ergonomics that set it apart from other 10mm pistols. It has a polymer frame with a relatively slim grip with interchangeable back straps that customize the angle and palm swell. There's plenty of real estate to allow for a good grip, but the grip isn't excessively thick or blocky. The texture on the grip and back straps is superb. The M&P 2.0 10mm uses a steel 15-round magazine with a polymer base plate. The pistol also sports sturdy, easy-to-feel, ambidextrous slide stops, and the magazine catch button is reversible for left-handed shooters. The controls were easy to operate with minimal hand movement for me, and the aggressive front cocking serrations made loading and unloading the gun a simpler task, especially with an optic mounted on it. The beveled edges and clean lines of the slide and frame made holstering and unholstering smooth and efficient. The break of the trigger is clean and crisp but the take-up isn't as smooth as I'd like. The gun isn't just reliable and fun to shoot, but it's plenty accurate too. I don't claim to be a skilled marksman, but this is one of the most accurate 10mm handguns I've ever shot. It had good accuracy out of the box, and things really start to tighten up once you add an optic. The 10mm is still a hot round that's going to produce some kick, but this M&P M2.0 eats it well and delivers fantastic results. I encourage anyone looking for a new pistol or caliber to check out the S&W M&P M2.0 in 10mm. You won't be disappointed. Glock 20 Gen 4 You didn't think we'd do a handgun write-up and leave the Glock off the list, did you? When it comes to reliability and capacity, it's hard to beat out Glock. This striker-fired polymer frame pistol has a 15 plus 1 capacity. It is heavy at 39 ounces, but that's to be expected when you're carrying this much firepower around. Unlike a similar gun from the same company, the Glock 40, this one is not set up with optics mounts to install a red dot. You'd have to get that separately. Glock includes three magazines standard with their Gen 4 models, which means you don't have to rush out to buy more right away. Three back straps allow you to adjust the fit to your hand and the magazine release can be reversed to make the gun ambidextrous. The safe action of this gun means you simply draw, aim, and squeeze when you need it. A hunting guide in New Mexico used a Glock 20 to kill an attacking bear just a few years ago, proving this can be an effective brush gun. Sig Sauer P220 Legion The P220 Legion is the most enhanced version of the gun that started it all from the modern-day Sig. Finished in the proprietary Legion Grey coating and featuring custom G10 grips with a Legion medallion, the P220 Legion is improved in nearly every way. The stainless steel slide sports Sig Sauer Electro Optics X-ray high-visibility day-night sights, as well as front-cocking serrations 
that provide greater purchase for cycling the action, clearing the firearm, or conducting press checks. The P220 in DASA includes a reduced and contoured elite beaver tail, which allows for a higher grip and a reduced profile, thus eliminating printing. More aggressive front strap checkering and additional checkering under the trigger guard enhance the grip. An X5 undercut has been applied to the trigger guard, allowing for a higher grip and greater control. The P220 Legion also features low-profile decocking and slide catch levers to reduce the risk of snagging. An enhanced polish action with the SRT short reset trigger is augmented with a Greyguns Inc. designed P8 trigger. In addition, a solid steel guide rod adds weight where it matters most. The P220 Legion ships with three 8-round magazines. Colt Delta Elite The Delta Elite, $1,100, is a classic 10mm handgun that's been around since the late 1980s and continues to impress and outperform its competition. Designed for people who love the classic Colt 1911 but want something a little more than only a 10mm can offer, the Delta Elite offers the best to both worlds. A gun worthy of self-defense, but powerful enough to take hunting. I like the Delta Elite because it's simplistic and effective. It's for the handgun owner who's concerned with performance and dependability, but doesn't want anything too flashy. This is evident by its basic design, which doesn't even come with a rail system. Although for an additional $100, you can buy the Delta Elite rail gun. The Delta Elite markets itself to the 1911 purists, the people who know and love the time-tested Colt 1911. But there's more to the Delta Elite than old-school cool in 10mm. It's got a double recoil spring system that takes some of the kick away from shooting 10mm, as well as a comfortable beaver tail grip safety that doesn't dig into your hand like other handguns. The Delta Elite performs just how you'd imagine a Colt 1911 would while also delivering a surprisingly comfortable grip. It's just got that timeless design you can't go wrong with. Dan Wesson – Commander Bobtail The Dan Wesson Commander Bobtail is a true masterpiece that seamlessly blends craftsmanship, performance, and power. As a passionate enthusiast of the 10mm auto caliber, I was thrilled to experience the exceptional quality and impressive capabilities of this handgun. With stunning brushed flats and bead-blasted rounds, a stainless steel slide, and frame and wood grips, this handgun is as aesthetically pleasing as it is capable. With an 8-round magazine capacity, a 4.25 inch length barrel, and bearing snag-free tritium sights, and a smooth bobbed mainspring housing, this is also a great concealed carry handgun. Like all Dan Wesson 1911s, Commander models incorporate top-quality parts from the best names in the industry. This pistol packs lots of power and accuracy in a compact platform, making it an absolute joy to shoot. The 1911 grip angle lends itself to the perfect balance, making it a natural extension of your arm. It has an extended beaver tail, offering the shooter a protected deep grip for positive control and accuracy when firing. The controls are well thought out and function flawlessly. The accuracy and precision of the Commander Classic Bobtail are top-notch. The match-grade barrel, coupled with the excellent trigger, allows for consistently tight groups and optimal shot placement. The single-action trigger offers a crisp break, with minimal travel ensuring a smooth and predictable pull that aids in overall accuracy. Its high price and lower magazine capacity may be drawbacks for some potential buyers, but its accuracy, durability, customizability, and ergonomic design make it a top choice for those who are willing to make the investment. Glock 40 Priced at $770, the G40 ain't cheap, but it just might be the closest you'll ever reach to 10mm perfection. In terms of how well the gun shoots, you can expect the G40 to perform similarly to its smaller sibling, the G20. Think of the G40 as Glock's 10mm handgun on performance enhancers. It's bigger and more accurate than other 10mm models because of its extended barrel which is just for 6 inches in length. While the G40 probably wouldn't be my first choice for concealed carry, its barrel length does make it an exceptional handgun to hunt with. The odds of you hitting and dropping that whitetail or wild hog will be better with the G40 
than with some of the other 10mm pistols out there. And since you get the same 15 plus 1 capacity as the G20, you also won't have any problem squeezing off any follow-up shots. The primary purpose of the G40 is to ensure long-range accuracy. For this reason, all models come equipped with the dual recoil spring system to help absorb any unnecessary kickbacks that come from firing 10mm cartridges. And while optics are sold separately, the G40 comes with a pack of base plates that makes your handgun ready for all the popular red dot systems, including Trichicon and EOTech Optics.